Big Board Sports with Roger Weiland. Well, hi, everyone. Happy New Year. I'm Roger Weiland. I wish you and everyone a great New Year. Hope it's gone well today and a lot better than it went for the University of Albany. On uh, Saturday, on uh, New Year's Eve, Eve day, they had a high noon game here at Hudson Valley Community College against New Hampshire. And UNH and Bill Harrion just came in in the first half and put this game away. They made shots. They ended up making 10 three-pointers on this game. And Albany just could never get Get on track. The scoring droughts that we have seen from time to time happened again. They were down by as many as 25 in the first half, 23 in the second half. Uh, the biggest lead for UNH was 27. Gerald Drumgool led U Albany with 15 points, but this was all about New Hampshire in a 67 to 51 win. Be. Uh, I was really disappointed with our effort. I was really disappointed with our toughness, but we have to learn from it. Um, you know, we have to find a way to be a tougher group of guys. And, uh, you know, hats off to Coach Heron. I think he's a really good coach. I thought they brought it to us. I thought we got to the rim a couple times. We couldn't figure out how to convert. Couldn't find a way to finish. And it really rattled us and frustrated us. And they got the first league win of the year. Um, I didn't think we made a quality statement about who we are and what we're trying to do. We got to get back to work. And the new year means you start with a clean slate one more time. And that's is it. There's no looking back after this. We came out slow and they came out hot and uh, we, we could just we never got a chance to get back in the game so it was a tough loss but you know we're gonna learn from it and move on I mean, it was just one of the tough one going in um, you know early on in the game we just wasn't able you know just wasn't able to convert you know we wasn't able to score we was just able to just find a basket and stuff like that so you know we had to just double down on defense and stuff like that so it was just hard you know not seeing just not seeing the ball go in the basket at the beginning and now for the great Danes they'll need to regroup in a hurry they go on the road next week on Thursday and play at UMBC I tell you who did ring in the new year with a big performance. Did you see Kevin Herter, a former Shannon Maryland standout? He hits the game-winning three for Sacramento to cap off a 30-point night, and the place went crazy in Sacramento. He had 30 points in 30 minutes, and the Kings took down the Utah Jazz 126 to 125. Congrats to Kevin Herter, and uh, yeah, that's that's quite the way to ring in the new year. Happy New Year. To everyone, I'm Roger Wyland for Big Board Sports. Thank you, Roger. Also in college basketball, Syracuse went toe to toe with Boston College and brought the win home. Joseph Gerard III led the Orange to victory with 24 points under his belt. And we'll be right back with a last look at the forecast. Stay with us.